Are you ready to bust some clutter? We have organization expert Eliza Cantley. We tackled the junk drawer earlier in the show and now we're headed to the coat closet. We're gonna look at a before photo of her client's coat closet. Kind of walk me through what was going on in here. Okay, so like a lot of coat closets, when you open them up, there was an excess of hangers, and they were all different kinds of hangers, uh, which can sort of create this visual clutter that really draws your eye to the hangers and not the important things, which is the items on the hangers. Also on the top rack, like I see in a lot of homes, there was a lot of stuff just sprawled around. There wasn't really anything to just contain thrown it in one place. kind of up there. Okay, yes, this is like a complete 180. Let's take a look at what you did and kind of walk me through your thought process and how you made over this coat closet. Sure, okay, the first thing I did was I installed one of these really simple pop lights. You can get them on Amazon. They're really great for lightening up dark spaces. Uh, then I took just a simple basket and all of the blankets that were up here, I just kind of corralled them right in, in the basket. One spot, no more sprawl. Then I made all of the hangers uniform. They all look the same so that they don't stand out at all. You're immediately drawn to the clothing. Uh, and then I added this double rod in the closet because of the kids. And then up here, instead of having dead space, we are able to put mini purses and you'll see that I used a shower hook oh, for that. Her. And then another thing we added down at the bottom is this boot tray. The boots were just kind of scattered. And then the final thing I want to point out is that I've used what is typically used for a shoe organizer on the inside of the door. And this is to get all of the items that the kids would have a hard time reaching. And then going up, we've got things that typically people want to just grab and go when they're coming in and out of the house. So we've got sunscreen and water bottles and we've even got pet supplies here. So it's just a nice spot to put everything on the way in and out. I have closet some, envy. She has some really great ideas, but they're so simple. Yeah, the you double know, rod would be a really great way to use up your space. Exactly, there. and what I love about Eliza, and I told her this, I said, you make it seem like this is something I could do. Right. Because you know, sometimes, <laughs> organ, sometimes I see an organization expert and I think, well, she's an expert, I'll never be able to do that. But it's so yeah. simple, so easy, and yeah, she's great. And ideally, we should be able to do it. We right. just have to do it. We just have to we just have to do it. And Dave's talking about money and budgeting and most importantly teaching your teenagers how to budget. Yeah, and as we